If you have a problem figuring out whether you're for me or Trump, then you ain't black. I don't care if he's pooped his pants. I don't care if he can't put a sentence together. Show me he can't do the job, and then I'll say, okay, maybe it's time to go. Notice I have more people supporting me in the black community that have announced for me because they know me. They know who I am. I don't care if he's pooped his pants. I don't care if he can't put a sentence together. Show me he can't do the job. And then I'll say, OK, maybe it's time to go. Lucky Joe, what a great advertisement. What else would we expect from the same woman who thought Jill Biden was a real doctor? Remember when she said this? I'm hoping yeah. Dr. Jill becomes a Surgeon General. His wife. Yeah. Joe, Biden. Joe Biden's wife, because she, you know, she he would been... never do it. But she, it, yeah, she's a hell of a doctor. She's an amazing doctor. I she's I just... a doctor. Ah, they never learn. Oh, Stephen, you have nails for breakfast. What's the matter? Why are you so honored? You miss me, huh? Oh, oh yes, sir. I, I miss you like a like a hog miss fly, <laughs> like a like a, a baby miss mammy titty. <laughs> I miss you like I misses a rock in my shoe. <laughs> if it's Biden in a coma, I'm gonna vote for Biden in a coma. I don't even really particularly like the guy. I, a lot of his policy don't like him. He's not Donald Trump, right? Yeah, Hitler, White House, we keeping them out, keeping Project 2025 out. That's all I care about. Up and down the ballot, from the rooter to the tutor, school board all the way up to White House and everything in between, governors, members of Congress. I'm just going to vote all the way down to keep these people out. You old decrepit bastard ought to show them every hospitality. You understand that? Yes, sir. You understand? Yes, sir. I, I understand. Well, I'm good. Y'all just tell me who the nominee is going to be. Let me know when you guys are finished fighting amongst yourselves who I got to vote for in November to keep Hitler out the White House. That's all I want to know. Who I got to vote for to keep Hitler out the White House. Y'all do your thing. Play in traffic all you want in front of these Republicans, acting a fool in front of these people instead of privately declaring your stuff. But don't text me no more because I'm not taking no more of these texts. Just let me know when you guys are finished figuring it out, Democrats, because I know y'all the freak out people. Go ahead and freak out. Have your conversation, and then let me know who I got to vote for to keep Hitler out the White House. That's it. I'm done. Oh, and by the way, if it's Biden in a coma, I'm going to vote for Biden in a coma. I don't even really particularly like the guy. I, a lot of his policy, don't like him. He's not Donald Trump, right? Yeah. Hitler, White House. We keeping him out. Keeping Project 2025 out. That's all I care about. Up and down the ballot from the rooter to the tutor. Number one. Number two, remember all this talk about how I don't have the black support? Come on, give me a break. Come with me. Watch. Watch. The American public is not going to move away from me as an average voter. And again, I'm here for two reasons, pal. One, to rebuild the economy for hardworking middle class people. Give everybody a shot. Just a straight shot. Everybody gets a fair chance. Number one. So I'm not going to sit here and say I'm going to do something that's only going to benefit black people. Two, remember all this talk about how I don't have the black support? Come on, give me a break. Come with me. Watch. Watch. Now, I want to tell you, no matter what anybody says, it ain't going to be no other Democratic candidate. It's going to be Biden, and we better know it. Democratic Party, we're watching you. Yeah. We are disappointed. Mm -hmm. We are angry, yeah. we are offended, yeah. mm -hmm. and we feel like we're being mistreated, misused, and disrespected. We will not continue to be disrespected by the Democratic Party. As I said yesterday, and I'll say today and tomorrow, if you're an independent candidate, Green Party candidate, Republican candidate, now is your time in this city. Joining us now, the Chicago... Uh, I might not like everything you're doing. Don't beat me, Massa. Please don't beat me, Massa. Don't beat that tired old body. No, don't. I don't like it all. But I'm going to stand behind you. Loyalty.